In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at File Browser Pro and look at how to use the native file browser, um, both in the Unity Editor and for builds as well. And you can see it's 38 bucks in the asset store right now. They've got good documentation. Um, I myself have been struggling to find an easy way to access the file dialog, um, and this makes life really easy. Show you what we're going to accomplish today. Uh, really simple app. We're just going to click a button to launch the dialog. Um, you can go to any folder click on a file and it'll spit out that file name. Uh, you can use this string to do all sorts of things, uh, open, save, uh, do various things with file dialog. So let's jump in. So here we are in Unity. I've already uh, downloaded the package. Um, you can tell because up here in tools it's added File Browser Pro. Um, their documentation shows you how to use all the goodies in there. For now, um, let's go ahead and just start by making that canvas that we saw. And we'll need a button. And we also need to add a text. Excellent. Right now that text is a little too high. We'll bring that down. We'll make it a little more readable as well. We'll make that say 20. And let's go ahead and change the font color. Great. Um, right now that text is too short for a very long path, so let's increase that size. We'll go ahead and go 800, and we'll go ahead and center that as well. Now let's make a script. And I'm going to name this open file. All right, so here we are. Uh, first thing we're going to do, we're going to add a couple things to the top here. We're going to say using unityengine.ui. And for the plugin, we need to say using crosstails.fb. Uh, FB stands for file browser. All right, we'll go ahead and get rid of start and update. And let's create public text, my text, public void, set text. And in here we're going to create a string. We'll call it my file string. This is what's going to hold the path and file name. And the command in the uh, plugin is file browser instance open single file and now here it takes parameter you can specify what extensions you want to show we're going to leave it as star so it'll show all file names but you could say txt or wav mob whatever you're trying to do all right um, let's now access that text and set it equal to my file string. That should be it. We'll save. Jump over to Unity. Beautiful. So next thing we want to do, let's go ahead and create a empty object and we'll name this script holder. Drag our open file script onto there. Notice we have this empty my text, so we'll drag text onto there. And last but not least, we're going to go into button and we need to create our on click event. Let's drag our script holder in here. Let's choose open file set text. That's what we just created. And if we did everything right, it should work. Here we are, click button. We see that white text. Here we have our browser. We can go anywhere. Um, and as long as our path is short enough to fit in the size that we specified, there we go. Um, if we have a really long path, you might just need to increase that. But now we have that as a string. You can do all sorts of things. Open file, open multiple files, open a folder, save file. Um, that's it for this tutorial on File Browser Pro.